Hey guys, so I'm back again today and I'm bringing you the stocking stuffer guide for her um, for 2016 and uh, I have a lot to talk about. I'm super excited about it. Totally getting into the festive spirit. It actually really snowed a lot here yesterday or last night and uh, this morning so it was really nice. It's now we have snow and it's supposed to kind of stay. It's supposed to be pretty cold here um, in Canada, uh, in Ontario. So yeah, awesome. I'm just going to get into it. So my first idea, because I have lots of ideas for you guys, my first idea is candy. You cannot go wrong with candy. And honestly, candy is pretty cheap. You can find it in pretty actually unusual spots. Okay, so the next thing is candles. I know these are kind of expensive. Um, these are Bath and Body Works candles, but this would be awesome in like the toe of a stocking. Um, lately, they've been having really good sales on on these. Um, this weekend, they had uh, all their Christmas candles were ten fifty, um, and they always have coupons. I have a ton of coupons. I'm like constantly, like I'm always giving them away because I don't need like I'm trying to like cut back on. Um, spending stuff and trying to use up what I already have. Um, so this is this year's. It's evergreen. <clears throat> smells like a Christmas tree. Um, but you can also get minis. They have minis. You can buy three for twelve fifty, I believe, um, here in Canada. And those would also make great, gr a great stocking stuffer. Um, they also have a, a single wick, too, which would be good, too. Um, either one, anything would work, really. <laughs> so... Going along with that, uh, Bath and Body Works also has candle sleeves. Um, this is for a mini one. I just grabbed it off my vanity because that's where it sits. Um, and, but it's it's really pretty. Like it's and it's really cheap. This one was five dollars. They have gone up in price, but Bath and Body Works has been upping their game with their candle sleeves. Um, now they have like snow globe ones, and like they have really kind of um, modern kind of minimalist looking ones. They had like a snowflake and I have seen a tree like a group of trees kind of thing. Um, but this is also really good and also pretty in inexpensive especially when you pair it with like coupons or something. Because um, they do have they always have like 20% off coupons or 10 off 30 or something like that. So this would go good. Um, even, it, even if it's not a candle sleeve you can get like soap sleeves you can get um, sleeves for like the fragrance mist and stuff. Um, so it doesn't have to be a candle sleeve. It could be something else. If they're more into the fragrances or more into the soaps or something, you could do that instead. Um, but I'm really into candles, so I like the candle sleeves. Um, and I love how it looks with the glitter and when it's lit and the light is bouncing off of it. Okay, so moving on. So the next, my next idea is kind of more of a high-end stocking stuffer, um, but if the person you're buying for is really into being organized like I am and really into knowing what the date is, <laughs> um, because sometimes life gets pretty hectic and I forget and I need to look it up, um, these cute little desktop, oops, this cute little desktop calendar is a great kind of stocking stuffer. It, like I said, it is a little pricey. This one I bought last year, or no, it was given to me last year by my aunt um, for Christmas, and it was $20. She had asked me what I wanted, and I sent this to her. Um, it is Kate Spade. So it's got this beautiful, like, uh, gold stand, um, and then it has these just, like, really thick, kind of, like, cardstock cards. So it has a gold foil. This is December. It's gold foil. And then it has the important dates are in gold foil as well. So the 24th, the 25th, and the 31st is gold foiled. On the back, it says, this is the month to be merry, string up tinsel at your desk, surround yourself with everyone you love, and sneak a kiss under the mistletoe. So not only is it great, not only is it like a great like desktop calendar, and I keep it in the office, like in my office slash classroom, or uh, craft room, sorry. Um, but I can use it next year and turn it around and just kind of use it as decor and say like this month we should do this. Um, I just think it's so gorgeous. But this year she has come out for next year for 2017. 
She just came up with a, another one. It has the same kind of gold. It's a little bit thinner and longer because the cardstock this year is thinner and it's a little bit longer this year. Um, so she's come up with another one and it's gone up in price. It's about 20, it's only $25 though. So it's not too bad. It's not, it's about the same as like buying like a three wick candle for somebody, which is $25 in, in Canada as well. So, and I love it. It's so minimalist. I've looked at it. I haven't seen the rest of it. Um, I've only seen like January's, but it looks, it's just so simple and minimalist. And right now I'm into like the simple kind of thing. Um, but I'm wonder. I hope it has the thing on the back because I really like the thing on the back too. Um, I think that's so cute and it's such a nice touch. And actually some of her planners this year, I have seen some of her planners have this, the, on the dividers for each month, it has a list of like things you should do this month. So I think that's a really great idea and it's not too expensive for a stocking stuffer. It is a little bit more high end for a stocking stuffer, but it'll get used all year, the next year. So, all right. So the next thing on my list is some, another thing from Bath and Body Works. And I actually love these is their Shea socks. They are the comfiest socks ever. And they have like the little grippies on the bottom so that you don't slide down the stairs in them because they, you would. If you didn't have the little grippies on the bottoms, you would. But they're so soft. They're so cute. Like, so stinking cute. Um, and this year, they have a whole bunch of them. Um, there's one. There's a pair, and I can't remember what animal it is, but they're holding, like, a like a string of lights or something. And it's so cute. I love it. And I think there's a pen. Right, the next thing are these. These are the Bath and Body Works, Body Works Hand Sanitizers. This is Winter. Uh, frosted cranberry and Christmas morning and I actually have this in a soap and I have winter in a soap um, and they smell really good so I'm excited to I'm excited to use these um, these are you buy three for five dollars and I believe right now they have seven for ten um, another thing I'm, I'm obsessed with to go with that and this is easy because you can split these into into gifts so what I usually do is like for my friends it's just an extra little add-on um, I'll buy one I'll buy one of these and then I'll buy a pocket holder these are all for me because I'm in love with them I'm obsessed I collect them <laughs> like, um, so I'll buy them a pocket holder and then I'll just put them together and and that'll be like part of their little gifts but this one's really cute it says shake and repeat and it's a little snow globe I don't know if you're going to be able to see it with the glare, but it's got like little like sparkles and snowflake sparkles in it. This was um, $5.50. They range in price. Uh, some of them are like really cheap. They're like a dollar. And then others are $3.50. Others are $5.50. It just depends on um, kind of what's on it and what's the, what they're made out of. So this is the other $5.50 one. Thought this was really cute for New Year's or in January. Um, you know, New Year, let's celebrate. I just thought it was so cute. Oh, so cute. Then I got this one, you know, feeling festive. A little bit of red. Um, and then I got, this is the last one. Oh, the red one was $3.50. This one was also $3.50. Um, and it's just candy cane with, like, sparkles in it, which is really So the next thing you can do is uh, you can get, uh, for the person who really likes makeup, um, Getting them a little kit like this uh, is really good. This is more high-end. Uh, so this is from Too Faced. It's from Sephora. It's $32. Um, so like I said, yeah, a little high-end, a little kind of more on the pricier side for a stocking stuffer. Um, but you can also split it into four different presents and uh, kind of get more of your bang for your buck and, like, you know, kind of put it in um, – Kind of attach it to an, to somebody's gift, like four different people's gifts or something. Um, but this is the melted Too Faced Melted Merry Christmas, the ultimate liquefied lip set. So you get chocolate honey, chihuahua, fig, and lady balls. Um, I've had fig before, I believe. I really like it. I haven't tried the other two, and I tried lady. I tried lady balls this weekend. I really liked it. Um, and lady balls is a melted matte. So my next thing is from 
bush. Um, I've I've never really I've never bought anything from there before. Actually, no, that's not true. I have. Um, I did buy the mask of magnanimity there before, and I loved it. Actually, I still have some of it. Um, and I believe my aunt has bought me stuff from there before too. But I've never really, I've never really gotten into it until like this year, until I've really started, you know, wanting to kind of relax and wanting to kind of, you know, unwind and stuff. So, um, uh, this year they had a pretty decent Christmas, uh, selection out. So I picked up some stuff from, from there and I think I'm going to do a separate haul just because, um, I, there's quite a lot in here. Um, but I did, so, anyways, I'll just tell you what it is. Um, so I think another good thing for a, um, for a stocking stuffer, and honey, if you're watching, I have a booklet, and I've marked stuff in it, so make sure you ask me, and you look through it, because I have stuff marked that I want in there. Um, so, is bath bombs. I think bath bombs are an awesome stocking stuffer. Um, these are awesome they're a little they're not they're not pricey I mean for the size like I'll just show you one I'm sure you guys have all seen this but um I think this is the mistletoe one I can't remember but I will do a separate video on the on what I what I got for the holiday set um but look at the size of this like this is huge um so for, for the most part they're about $6.95 some of them are a little bit more. Some of them are $7.95. Some of them are $8.95. Um, so they're a lot cheaper than other things that I've shown uh, thus far. But I think this would be awesome. I For somebody who really likes to just, you know, unwind. After a hard day, like, just unwind. You know, they smell amazing. And it's it's natural products. Like, they don't, it's 100% vegetarian. Um, they don't do animal testing. They're ethic, ethical buying. Um... They're, I love this company. It's, it's awesome. Like, so bath bombs, I also picked up, I'm also into, um, bubble bars. And bubble bars are, they're about the same prices as the bath bombs. This little guy is, his name is Snowy. And he's a tribute to David Bowie. And I just thought he was so cute. I act, And all you do is you just run him under the bath. And, uh, it gives you, you can use as little or as much as you want, and it gives you bubble bath. So basically, it's just like a, it's a bubble bar, so you get bubbles from it. Um, so I have yet to use him, but, uh, hopefully I will use some of this stuff in the coming weeks, uh, leading up to Christmas. Ugh, covered in sparkles and stuff now. Ooh, okay. Um, but yeah, I think those are really great, and pretty cheap, I'll pretty cheap um, stocking stuffers um so I would love I would love to get some of these in my stocking and especially if I use some of them like um yeah I would totally love to get some of those but the next thing is like a book or a magazine look at the bargain section in chapters the bargain section I have gotten so many good deals out of there it's been insane like I've gotten some pretty nice organizing books for like under ten dollars which is awesome because, like, I'm really into organizing. Okay, so my next idea is nail polish. You cannot go wrong with nail polish. Some of my favorite brands are OPI, uh, which you can find at, like, drugstores and stuff. Um, Sally Hansen is another drugstore one. Pretty cheap. Uh, they usually go for about $10. Um, but sometimes, sometimes they're on sale. You can find some ones that are on sale. Or you can find, like, gift sets. Sometimes there's gift sets. Um, Essie is another one, and Essie just came out with, like, a gel, a gel one, um, it's, like, a nail, it's, like, a, uh, they, they changed the formula, I think, and then there's, like, a gel top coat that goes over it, and then it's supposed to be, like, gel nails kind of thing, um, I haven't tried that one, I'd like to, um, it's just, it's a little bit more pricey than the original Essie ones, so, I haven't really tried it yet but there are some colors that I really like I'm into like the darker ones um so that's an idea um so on the higher end uh there is uh formula formula x which is a sephora one 
Um, and I really like those. Uh, and uh, what is it? Ciate. I'm hope I hope I'm saying this right. Ciate is also a brand that you can find at Sephora in the nail polish, I believe. Um, I know Sephora had like nice little. Which one was it? There was one. There was a set that I really liked from Sephora, and it was like. You got like six nail polishes, and one of them was like a top coat, and then there was like five other nail polishes. It was called like Chic in the City Clicks or something like that, and they all clicked into like a like a plastic like bar at the top, and then you can just, it's like a travel thing, like you just take it with you, and that way you have like, you have like five nail polishes to, cho to choose from. Um, so I think that was, I think it's an awesome idea, and I can't, I don't, so the next thing is, I don't have it with me either, but it's, um, like tumblers, like either like a tumbler, a drinking glass, or like a travel mug. I already have enough travel mugs. <laughs> I love travel mugs, but even a tumbler, drinking glass, like that'd be it'd be so great. Like just sitting in like my office or whatever with like a little drinking glass. Kate Spade has really nice ones. Um, they're about eighteen dollars, so they're not too bad. Um, but you can find them everywhere. Like they're everywhere right now. Starbucks has some really nice ones too. They're a little bit more. I think they're a little bit more expensive. Because, yeah, I was going to buy a mug that I really liked. It was, like, polar bears on it. And it was, like, 18, it was $19. So I was, like, whoa, like, this is just a mug. Like, it was crazy. So I didn't end up getting it. So, the, I mean, that's another idea. A mug. Like, mugs, too. Like, those are awesome. Everybody loves a mug. Um, but, yeah. So, like, a tumbler, a mug, a drinking tumbler. Like, just something that, like, you know, like, they get some use out of kind of thing. So then my, another idea I have is some things that they would, things that they need. So things like, such as like, um, hand cream. So this is by Bath and Body Works. It's fresh sparkling snow. I got this last year. Here's this. I got this. This is chopstick. Um, it's candy cane. Um, it smells so great. Oh, it smells awesome. Uh, and I found this randomly at like Giant Tiger. I think it was like three bucks or something. Which, I mean, is a total steal. Um, what else? Things like razors. Like, I have a, um, I kind of, tr I'm trying to move away from disposable razors. And so I have one that I really love. It's like the Hydro 5 or something like that. So I have, like, the cartridges for it. But, like, always, like, getting new stuff, like, getting, like, cartridges and stuff for it is awesome. Like, that would be totally awesome. And, like, things like hair bands. So I'm always running out of hair bands and bobby pins and, and stuff like that. So things like people, like they would actually need band-aids, like cool band-aids. Like if they have like, you know, like designer prints on them or something, like that'd be really cool. Um, yeah, another idea I was thinking, just think, I just thought of actually to go along with like things that they would need is um, chapters and Sephora sell this thing called a mini, a mini emergency kit. Um, so it comes in like a little bag like this. And it has, like, it has, like, everything. It has, like, um, needle, sewing needles and, like, thread and band-aids and wire elastic and breath mints and um, a bunch of different things. And I would love to get one. And they're they're $22. Um, and there's one at Chapters that's, it's, like, a black, it's black and it looks studded, but it's not. It's just, like, the pattern on the, on the fabric. Um, and I would, I've been eyeing it for so long. I just can't, I can't bring myself to buy it for myself. But it is something that would be really nice to just kind of throw in my purse um, or my backpack for school just in case. Um, so, yeah, so that would be an idea kind of thing of things that, like, just things that are needed. Like, so, like, razor cartridges or razors, um, hand cream, lip balm, band-aids, mini emergency kits, stuff like that. Um, okay, so then my next thing is like tech stuff so again falls kind of under the things of things you would need so things like bad like power banks for your cell phone or cords so like you can so that you have a cord in the car or something to charge your phone if you need to um just uh yeah just like great like just tech stuff like tech stuff like that like or like you know extra usb um B sticks um because I'm forever losing mine and then years later I find them um uh, actually no that's not true this year I've been pretty good because I have like a spot in my desk that I keep them all so I keep them all there and then um 
that way I know where they are. Um, and then, like, yeah, just, like, little stuff like that. Batteries. I mean, I'm always using batteries. I have all this, like, stuff that, like, crafty stuff that, like, requires batteries and stuff. So, um, those are good, too. But, yeah, definitely, like, the lip balm and, like, the mini emergency kit and stuff. That would be awesome. Okay, so my last thing is for the for another thing for the people who are very, like, organized and who are very, like, kind of crafty and into this whole planning thing. I've been, like, obsessed, obsessed with this planning thing, this whole planning craze. Um, so my last thing, my last stocking stuffer idea for her is, um, planner accessories. So these are just two of them. Um, I don't have everything with me. It's, I've kind of like been using and stuff. These are just two things I just randomly had up here because I was working on my planner earlier. Um, but these are the sticker value packs from me and my big ideas for the happy planner. And they are a bit of, they are expensive. They are 30 bucks in Canada. So a little bit more, again, a high-end stocking stuffer. Um, but they are coming out with 13 more value packs. And I want every single one except for the one of them. And I wouldn't even mind if I got that one too because whatever. It's, it's pretty stupid. Um, so anyways, this, these, are the value, these are the value sticker packs. They also have like deco pens, which I wouldn't mind getting. There's one called, it says like, nope, not today. Uh, rescheduled kind of thing. Then there's a weather one. There's a Christmas one that I wouldn't mind getting. Um, they're just really cute. They're just um, the deco pens are like cartridges, and it's kind of like you know those whiteout. Um, it's not like the brush and the and the liquid. It's like that like stick kind of thing. It's like that. That's what it's like. It's like those whiteout pen kind of things. Um, then they have yeah. So the sticker packs would be great. It's a dollar pretty much. You get thirty sheets. So it's a dollar per sheet, pretty much, which is awesome because you get, like, a ton of stickers. Um, this is the one that, the new one that most recently came out. Um, just, like, gorgeous. Like, huge, like, quotes. Like, some more quotes. More quotes, more quotes. Like, look at all that. Like, look at all of these stickers. Gorgeous floral. Like, I'm in, totally in love with this. And then, like, actual stickers that fit in the boxes that you can write on, um, which is awesome. Like, just absolutely gorgeous. Like, ugh. And then, like, appointment stickers. More hearts. More hearts. More, like, to do, to buy, to do, remember. Then they have these, these double boxes. Ugh, that you can write on. So awesome. So awesome. And like I said, they have 13 more. So I'm making my list. It'll be in my planner where I keep everything. Um, and uh, of the sticker packs that I want. I, there's also some new mini. I have a mini planner and there's some new mini accessories coming out. There's like pocket pages I wouldn't mind getting. Um, there's like a sticky note pack that they're coming out for the mini. Uh, there's, a, there's some other things. Um, but honey, again, if you're watching... This will be my planner, <laughs> um, like my gift, my gift wish list was. Um, but yeah, just awesome, like pens, like anything, like you know, cute little like sticky notes. Um, Chapters has has some. They always have some. That's usually where I buy them. Um, yeah, just paper clips, stuff like that. Etsy's a really good place to find a lot of planner stuff. Um, but that was everything. I hope you guys really enjoyed this. I enjoy watching these videos. I enjoy doing these videos. I really enjoy coming up with this stuff for you guys um, based on, you know, what I've liked throughout the year, what I would like to get for Christmas and like in my stocking. Um, yeah, so comment down below. Let me know what you guys like to get in your stocking or what you've gotten in the past. I would love to, I would love more ideas. Um, be sure to subscribe. I'm definitely having more videos coming out. Uh, there might be like a couple of DIY videos. Um, and the rest will be kind of just unboxings. And there might be like a vlog here and there. Um, I am doing vlogmas, but or at least trying to. My internet's down right now. It kind of sucks. But um, 
I am doing vlogmas, but it's not going to be like me vlogging every day. Uh, there might be just be one or two here and there. Um, I'll try and vlog like Christmas Eve and Christmas Day, but um, that'll probably be like combined into like one. So you probably won't see it till like Christmas Day <laughs> or like Boxing Day or whatever. So yeah, so I don't know. But anyways, I'll have to figure out if you have any ideas of what you kind of want to see. If you want to see like a plan with me for Christmas or um, yeah. Just like let me know. Let me know in the comments. Uh, and thank you so much for watching. And until next time, guys, happy holidays. Bye.